This is episode 75. So are you dreading all of the tasks that you have to do for the day? Do you wake up just dreading the day overall? And do you want a very easy and simple way to do things that you don't really want to do? Well, in today's episode, I will give you my secret tip on how you can have a very productive, positive, and happy day. Welcome to the Calm Marketer Podcast. My name is Kenneth Fong, a digital marketer on a mission to help businesses thrive. I'll bring you on my marketing journey where you'll get to learn from my experiences as an INFP navigating an extroverted world and get actionable marketing tips for your business. Thanks for spending some time with me today. Now let's begin. So on Monday, I had a really great day and I think I manifested that great day exactly how I wanted it to go. I'm currently reading this book called The Magic by Rhonda Byrne and this past Monday was chapter uh was chapter, I think 12 it was, let me see. Actually chapter 14. And it teaches you how to have a magical day, you know, how to have your day run smoothly and in the best way possible. So it all starts in the morning. When you wake up, before you even get out of bed, Uh, Think of all the things that you have to do for that day. So if it's client work, if it's things you need to do for your business, if it's specific tasks that you need to complete, chores or errands that you need to run, go through everything that you need to do. And in your mind, imagine yourself completing all of those tasks and having completing them extremely well and feel yourself having done all of those tasks perfectly and feel great having doing them and completing them. So when you think of your tasks for the day, just go through it in your mind the way you imagine it you would like to go. And just imagine yourself, you know, say at the end of the day, when you look back and say, okay, I did this, I did that. It went extremely well. You know, my client was so happy I did this. You know, my boss was so happy. She said this, I got this. Just imagine it and feel as if everything went exactly the way you wanted it to go. And that's the most important part is the feeling part. You need to really put emotion into it and make sure that you are truly feeling grateful for everything that you completed that went extremely well. You're grateful for everything that went extremely well for the day. And um, again, just use your imagination to think of everything going extremely well. And Rhonda, mentions that you know after you finished feeling that gratefulness for all the plans in your day going perfectly well going brilliantly well you need to end this magical practice by saying quote and thank you for the great news coming to me today end of quote so thank you for the great news coming to me today So you are already telling the universe that you are grateful for not only all of the plans that happened during the day, but you are thankful for the great news that is coming to you that day. And um, it's crazy because it's something that it's, you know, you are giving out to the world what you are expecting to have right so it's definitely very powerful and 
it's funny because I did this exercise and I went through my day and everything was so easy for me. Like I completed everything. My clients were happy. I didn't have any fussiness or any roadblocks I had to had to jump over. Um, it was a pretty smooth day. And at the end of the day, I did get some good news, you know. Um, we had some meeting planned for Wednesday that was pushed to the next week. And that was my good news. Um, sometimes, you know, as an INFP, um, having meetings all the time is not always something that I like. So this particular meeting was pushed back and that was my good news for the day. So um, it was, it ended perfectly, my day ended perfectly. And it was all because I manifested it by feeling grateful for all of the, the things that I completed. I made sure that my imagination was around completing all of my plans perfectly and ending extremely well. So try this magical practice out. Um, these tips are really what will help you to have a great day, have a successful day. So try these out and good luck. So I will speak to you on the next episode.